guys, today I'm going to cook a spicy lamb sausage. So let's get toasting. I've got some spicy lamb sausage from the Panazera Meat Company. This is a local company. There's a little store near me that sells this. They, I think the place they make it is about 20 minutes from here. Um, kind of expensive. This was $19.59 for four sausages. It's $19.99 a pound. I've seen this before and I haven't tried it just because of the price. I've tried their pork and their uh, chicken sausages. They're usually less money, about $10 a package. Um, so anyway, I thought I'd just buy some of this and try it. Now this was frozen, so I cooked two of them already just to try it out, and I, they were frozen, but I pulled this out of the freezer last night. So this one will be thawed, so it should cook faster. And uh, seem like the others dried out a little bit, so maybe they won't dry out as much because it seemed like they had to be, uh, you know, in the pan a little longer. So anyway, and I've got a pretzel bun, pretzilla uh, sausage bun. So I have one of these, so I should be able to just kind of um, heat this up at the same time as I do the sausage here, I think. So I put everything in this 10-inch cast iron skillet here. Just put the bun in there like that, and this would be good in the uh, on the grill, but it's raining today, so I'm just going to do it in my toaster oven. I'm setting my oven to bake at 450 degrees Fahrenheit, and I'll just keep an eye on this. The bun looks like it's getting pretty toasted, so I'm going to pull that out of there, but I don't think the sausage is done yet. We'll get that back in there. Been about 10 minutes. This should be about done, I think. The frozen ones I cooked for about 15. Yeah, I think that's good. I just used mustard on this last time, but I thought it was a little bit dry, so I put a little bit of mayonnaise on that side of the bun this time. And put some mustard on the top there. And get the sausage here. Okay. There we go. Alright, let's try this out. Casing's a little bit chewy. I think it's a little bit moisture cooking it thawed like that because it didn't have to be in the oven as long. But it has pretty good flavor. I think I like this better, like I said, cooked thawed like that. And I think the mayonnaise helped out a little bit as well. Wanna try it out, Andy? Let Andy see what she thinks here. <laughs> She ate it bun and all. Those pretzel buns are good. That was pretty good. The first two I cooked from frozen I wasn't that happy with because I thought they were a little dry. So it definitely works better to let them thaw out first before you cook them. Now I don't know if I'd spend that much money on those again, but it's fun to try new things. Um, I like their pork and their chicken ones as well, and they're about half the price. Actually, they have a website, so I'll put the link to that in the description just in case anybody's interested. Anyway. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys next time.